Hello, I'm Dr. Michelle Jorgensen with Total Care Dental and Wellness, and today I want to talk about food combining. Now, when I first learned about food combining, I was really put off by it because it just seemed so complicated, and I thought, people are struggling just to eat well as it is, let alone trying to eat this way. Well, the interesting thing is, is I've really applied some of these things in my own life, and the difference I feel is literally night and day. So this is worth it, and it doesn't have to be that complicated. So let me explain the bottom line with it. When you eat carbohydrate foods, what they do is they actually require alkaline juices in order to digest them. When you eat protein foods, so those are meats, dairy, those kinds of foods, when you eat those foods, they require acidic juices to digest them. So when you have that typical meat and potatoes meal, the acidic juices are coming to, to digest the meat, the alkaline juices are coming to digest the potatoes, and they actually cancel each other out. What happens is that food ferments in your gut, you get gassy, bloaty, you know the fillings because you felt them oftentimes and you don't know why. You think, oh, what did I eat? It wasn't that bad, it was just the food I always eat. Well, it may be just the combination of foods eating them together. So here are the bottom line basics. Those carbohydrate foods, so those are grains, those are gonna be your starchy vegetables like potatoes, those things cannot be eaten with protein foods. They can be eaten with every vegetable in the book pretty much. So what I think about is we say, okay, we're gonna have a carb meal today. So for example, we have a stir fry with rice and we use a ton of delicious veggies, but I don't throw meat in with it. So we just have veggies, we have rice, maybe we make a, a little bit of a broth soup that doesn't have chicken or anything in it. You know, broth soup, you can throw some noodles in there. So carbs, but no meat and you'll find that you digest very well when you do it that way. Now, the next day, maybe we'll say, okay, we're gonna have a protein meal today. So then we have a great big salad and maybe we put a little bit of fish on with that salad. We put a little bit of um, goat cheese or something with that salad as well. So now we've added tons of vegetables because you can eat meat and vegetables, you can eat carbs and vegetables, it's just the meat and the carbs you can't put together. So we have that meat meal where we have tons of veggies, a big salad, whatever it might be, along with that meat and you'll find you're gonna digest a lot better. Another thing is that meat digests very slowly. It takes about three hours to leave your system or to even leave your stomach. Carbs take about two hours to leave your, leave your stomach. So if they're trying to compete with getting out at the same time, that also backs things up. So there's another category of foods that shouldn't be eaten with anything and that's fruits. Fruits should always be eaten first, particularly melons. Melons should be all on themselves. So when you have a meal and you have you know watermelon sitting there along with everything else, don't eat it at the same time. So what we do in our family now is we cut the melon first and we have it sitting on the counter and everybody comes and grabs a little one. You know how they're always wanting to do that anyway. So they come and they grab a little bit of melon and they eat it and I eat it as I'm prepping the meal and we just have the melons first. That way it's moved through and it's on its way down to where it needs to go and it's not interrupting or interfering with anything else. Fruit, we always do first as well. That's the first part of our meal. So that happens all on its own. Then choose either a carbon veggie meal or a meat and veggie meal. I challenge you to do this. You may think it's really hard, but it actually isn't as hard as you might think. I just want you to be conscious about it. And what I think you're gonna find is that you digest and feel so much better. So give it a try and see how you feel. And I think you're gonna actually love it.